with your truest self. Chivalry is not dead. In the bedroom, uh, yeah. we always want the man to be the man. If you ask a woman what she wants in a man, you better have a bottle of vodka in six hours. I'm going to man you up. You don't just let anybody into the temple. Less is more. Yo! Oh. <laughs> that is so Doritos and Cheetos. It's cheesy, cheesy, cheesy. Before we get going, your name. Siggy yeah. Flicker. Siggy it's great. Flicker. Is that, City Slickers. Uh, is it, <laughs> City Slickers, City Flicker. Yes. Is it I, your real it name? It is my real name. And you know what? If I had to make up any name in the world, do you think I would make up Siggy Flicker? First of all, you have to have physical chemistry with somebody. The person that you're sitting across from, you want, you're going to want to kiss them at some point. Then there's got to be intellectual chemistry. If the person across from you can't spell Bob backwards, it's going to die. <laughs> Something is going to fall apart. And then there's emotional chemistry. How many people come to me, I'm ready for you to match me, but actions speak louder than words, and they're not emotionally available to date at that moment. And the fourth one is my, the most important one is spiritual chemistry. When you think of somebody spiritually, you think of somebody who's kind, giving, and loving. You want to be with somebody who's generous and kind with his time, heart, and soul. Why? Because life isn't a box of chocolates. There's going to be good times, and there's going to be bad times. Everybody believes in having a great job and a great career, but there's something more important. It's called love. You don't want to be 80 or old rocking on that chair saying, I had a great job. That's great, but it's not that important as loving. Twice a week, because why? Chemistry is a mystery. It doesn't happen overnight. The more you date, the closer you are to finding the lid to your pot. But what I say is, never fear rejection. A man's rejection is God's protection. She... She didn't stay down. Wendy, she got right back up there. And if this Oliver Martinez can make Diane Lane and Unfaithful shake in her panties, right? Halle Berry, shake it! <laughs> I wanted Ryan and Rachel McAdams to be together. But guess what? He found his match with Eva Mendez. They are having sex from chandeliers. They are swinging it. I am loving it. Loving it! Oh. I'm like, how dare you become people's number one most best-looking man? You're 90 pounds. He weighs more. My breast weigh more than him. He is a baby. In your 20s, it's a time for you to get to know yourself, what you like and you don't like. In your 30s, you got to know where you're heading to. And in your 40s, you better know where you're heading to. And if you're like me and you fall flat on your face, you got to pick yourself back up and get back out yep. there. J-Lo and Casper Smart. Don't, don't do this to me. Now, here's a woman. She can bring home the bacon. Fry it, fry it up, up in, in the, the pan. pan. And then get her man to sign a confidentiality agreement. Be call her she can, because she is J-Lo. I do not believe in limiting yourself to only being matched with millionaires. I'm marrying a car salesman, and I'm no longer faking my orgasms. Oh. I'm okay. Men who say women today are butchy. They're too butchy. It's like time for us to, we could be smart and have uteruses and produce and do 19 things at once, but lean back and let the man be the man. That to me is a turn oh, yeah, It depends on what type of woman you are. You were looking to play? Hook up. You're looking for somebody to take you seriously? That part of you is a temple, it's a mystery. You don't open it up and hook up with every Tom, Dick, and Harry that comes along. We all want the best for our children. I get up every day and stress, education, education, education. Where are you guys going, Sophie and Joshua? They say Harvard. My kids are not getting into Harvard. <laughs> I mean, they're bright. They're not that bright, though. God bless them. I love them with all my heart. But it is borderline insane. These mothers on these TV shows need to get a life and stop living vicariously through their children. Yeah. I think it's very important as parents. I know a lot of parents today raise their kids. They try to be best friends with their kids. Not in my house. I'm not your best friend. I'm your mother. You came out of my body. I did not come out of yours. Oh, <laughs> First of all, she is everything that a man wants in a woman. This is... This is everything that I wish every one of my clients was. What you did is 100% wrong. You, 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 you will never, ever look at her. And you better walk and never turn around again. Let him say what he's going to say. You're loved. You have the rest of your life in front of you. You cannot let this make you depressed, hold you back. I mean, look at this. Real tears coming from people who actually wanted to believe so bad that you were their blood. And guess what? This is going to last forever, this bond. Do you want an amazing life, yes or no? Yeah, you want to live, right? Yeah, What's happening yeah. here is not amazing for you, is it? This is, I'm dreaming. You I'm telling you right now, you just stop dreaming. This is what you need to do. You need to walk away nightmare. from this toxic relationship. Yeah. You walk away from this toxic relationship.
Okay, you watch are... this. It's as easy as this. Compliment a good-looking guy like this. I love your tie. He's That's gonna it. say thank you. you guys my are hot. Uh, my yeah. life. If he says that work for you guys. Or, yeah. I love your shoes. <laughs> sure. You're gonna say thank you. My wife bought it for me, and I'd say, oh, then, oh okay. Then you know all you need to know. Watch. You, your wife has great taste, and thank you move you. forward. Move on. Move on, people. I like Siggy. Yeah, Siggy, come back and see us. Yeah. Right.